Hello everybody and welcome back to Spinner Salad. I'm Sal and I'm continuing my blind playthrough of Kirby's Dream Land 3. This is part 8 and we're doing the second half of level 4, Cloudy Park. We still have the flame ability and now we're just going to be flaming through everything here. Apparently we're not going to be flaming through everything here because I can't play the game. I literally can't get- I'm actually mad that I couldn't get that guy. <laughs> Okay, are we supposed to open up these flowers? I we, Sometimes we're supposed to do stuff for flowers, but I'm still questioning what that stuff is. I don't know if we're not supposed to touch certain flowers while we touch the other ones. I'm not sure. We're not burning this flower, so that's not doing anything. <laughs> also, great music. Who doesn't love this track? Shoutouts to everyone who knows exactly what this track is. Oh, we got some flyers. Can we- wait, what's the button? It's X. I always forget. Alright, cool. Let's go. We got one life. And we gotta fly through here. Whoa. Now we have, uh, some more food, so that's good. I just lost my power-up, so that's less good. So we can still inhale and shoot and stuff, but other than that, uh, we're doing pretty badly. <laughs> I am doing pretty badly in this game. We did get a one-up from the, uh, star pieces. So that's good. Whoa, this guy. This guy's fun in Kirby Planet Robot though because when you use the mirror ability, then he, um, like, like half of him, if he's in the background, it'll go back to him. Wait, there's food down here. I wanna get the food. I actually can't go back. Wow, okay. Can we get the spark? We got the spark at least. That does something for us, something for our morale. We get the lightning coming out of- wait, we can just hold this, and then we're like this. We become super- Wait, there's a one-up, there's a one-up, there's a one-up. Alright, we got the one-up. We're up to three lives. I never thought I'd have to collect lives in a Kirby game. And there's a Metamato, I will take that. They act like there's a boss fight coming up, but there's no mini-bosses in this game. Oh, we probably could've gotten those guys down there. Do we have to? Wait. No, we can't actually go back up that way to try to get them with the lightning. Uh, okay. There was only one guy there. I thought I saw two there before. Wow. It's really hard to use the lightning because you can only get stuff that's directly below you and stuff that's a little bit next to you. Kind of tough to time it and stuff. At least we get the spider and the cutter. I didn't want to inhale the cutter because I didn't really want to get thrown around. Because when you are paired up with Ku and you have Cutter, you get thrown around a bit. Okay, maybe I should have taken Cutter. Maybe we'll just take Flame. Wait, I didn't mean to leave you, Ku! I pressed the wrong button. Can we fly back? I want to have Flame. Okay, we're Flame now. This may or may not work out. We're gonna see. We're going through the door. Parasol is nice when you have Ku because you just spin through everything. With flame, you just dive bomb. I mean, fire. Wow, we wrecked that girl. We didn't wreck that girl. I want this, and then I want to do this. Okay. Look at her spin out of existence. <laughs> that other one on the left exploded. What is this guy? Th Wait, this is a mini boss. Also, I'm dead. So we're doing our first mini boss of the game, and he's throwing stools. I I don't know. Is this stool man? I'm kind of confused. I can't really be up here because I'm just stuck in this cloud. We have to like jump or something. Oh my goodness! Or we can run back and forth in this very tiny arena. Is he gonna throw something at me? Is he gonna throw another stool? Because that's my only ammunition against this guy. I sure hope it does more than one damage. Uh, this is a problem. I don't have anything to defend myself. We got one hit in, and it counted as two, I think. I hope.
I, I can't, I can't, you know, you know. We ran back for a power-up because I was not going to do the rest of this boss fight without one, and I really should have listened to myself earlier because that lasted all of three seconds. <laughs> Wait, this guy. I can't help the orange. I can't fly over to him. What is this? Okay, it's another section, but instead of going down, we have to go up. There's a hidden star piece here. They thought we wouldn't see it, but we did. Is there another one here? There is, and we missed it. Gotta get Kaboo! Alright, there's a star piece here. There's probably another one up there, but it's- I, I'm not able to really get them because of the wind. Yeah, the wind- the wind streams are messing me up. <laughs> it's very difficult. Alright, we're going back. We're heading back. We're heading back. This guy's like the Yeti or something. Alright, end of the level. We disappointed everybody, so let's just- Yeah, sorry Mr. Bag Snowman, I did not- Or maybe it's supposed to be a cloud, maybe it's not a bagged snowman. I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Alright, we got the bad face. We did not jump to the correct distance. <laughs> and now... Wait, this looks like Rick, but like a girl Rick. <laughs> like Kim. Ah, I was trying to spark him. Spark's been working out pretty good for me in the past five minutes. Okay, maybe we need Cutter. Not a need necessarily, but definitely a, a strong want. Wow, I just can't play this game apparently. Get the little yeti dude. I don't know what he's called. They don't give names as you're meeting these people and I don't have the manual in front of me so I can't check it. We got the sniper. I don't want to get sniped. I don't want to keep getting sniped. I want to get the sniper. That's what I want to- Wait! I just saw some enemy fire come from the left. Even though the enemy had despawned on screen. How do I keep not avoiding these arrows? How am I this bad at avoiding the arrows? Okay, I don't- we're, There's some sort of screen film in front of us or something. I don't know. You get to see Kerbo's face. We're avoiding the Bronto Birch just fine. I wish you could guard in this game. Ooh, we get to choose a friend before we die. Or if we die in this room, because I think we can die if we fall down here. I'm pretty sure we're gonna die anyway, but maybe we won't. You never know. I don't want to waste a life if I don't have to. Whoa. Wait, this is what it's like with Koo. Nice, he just throws his wings, just like in Kirby's Dream Land 2. Well, it's a little different in Kirby's Dream Land 2, but it's a, sim a similar concept. What is that hat guy doing? He's wearing a thatched hat on his head. I can't believe that some people just zoom th through here and cause their thumbs arthritis trying to get the world record on this game. Because, <laughs> in case you didn't know, if you're doing a speedrun of this game, basically the entire time you're just flying with Koo. The Gordos. We're being very careful avoiding these Gordos. Do we just keep going up? There's a star piece right here. Free star piece. There's probably stuff on the left, but we're not gonna go try to find it. We're just gonna fly. Oh my goodness, we almost get hit by that guy. We only have one hit left on us before we lose another life. What was that guy swinging down there? Well, I shouldn't have looked at the guy swinging down there because now I'm out of here. It's just not the same without Koo. Cause you're just flying really slowly and puffing things out of existence. It's just not the same. And we didn't even bring her our friend. Were we supposed to bring her Choo Choo? It's probably- the mission's probably if you bring them Choo Choo. Wow, I just cannot get anything correct, can I? I'm trying to get the 1-up, but it's not- I lost it. I lost my skill. What is this guy? It looks like some sort of giraffe thing? I don't know. Wait, are these guys frozen or painted? Uh, I thought these enemies were real. Is this a fake out one? Because I don't know which enemies are real and which ones are fake. Maybe they're all crayon drawings? I'm not sure what's going on. Is this some sort of cloudy palace? Wow, what is this dude? He, he wrecked that. How do we- did we need that dude's powers? I don't understand what we're doing here. 
We can't get those. Do we need him to break all the blocks? We just need to re keep resetting? Alright, guy, you win. Defeat all the blocks that I am underneath of. Come on, get the star pieces for me. Yay, thanks! Alright, now open the door. Oh, I didn't get over to the door in time. Alright, the door is here. If you could just please open a pathway for me, thanks. Alright, I guess that's what you had to do. I don't know what you'd get if you try to eat him for a copy ability, but oh well. Good thing we're not jumping into the cannonballs this time. And we're leaving those shut so that we don't get hit by any cannonballs. Smart move by me. Get away from the thwomps, which are in Cloudy Park for some reason? Whoa, we have friends to choose from. I'm trying to run over them, but I can't. I think we have to go through all the doors. Oh, I, it's like a puzzle again. We gotta remember which one they were in. I think the one that I wanted was in door number three. So what what do you get from them anyway? Nothing, you don't get anything. You, didn't, you don't get any of his world opening abilities. All right, I did get the right one. We are back with Koo. I love how insulted my friends always look when I choose someone else over them. Alright, I'm pretty sure this is the exit door. I might be wrong. I- maybe it's because my hitbox is bigger with Koo and I'm not used to that, but I always get hit. And I don't like getting hit. I'm down to not a lot of- I didn't want to go back in the door. I wanted to go up here. I need to go to the left before I do that because if you go up straight away it'll think you're going through the door again. Okay. Can we? I don't think this guy gives us anything. When when is there gonna be a guy that gives us stuff? Whoa, this guy looks so passive and peaceful. Too bad that we have to destroy him by exploding everything. Whoa. Look at how fast I can shoot these things. It looks so weird. The screen's widescreen because the clouds are taking up the top and bottom portions of the um, section for gaming. Oh, wait. Wait, should I have gone through that door? We're gonna go through the door. What is this? I don't understand this. <laughs> okay. That's a weird thing to walk through a door to. I can't- I keep- mm, Can I eat these guys? Technically I can, but technically they're just gonna keep hurting me anyway. Wow, there's so many of these dudes. This is some enemy spam right here, but very neat and organized enemy spam. Right, door number two, I guess. And yeah, I guess we're just flying through all this. Taking damage for some reason, even though it isn't a speed run. All right, I want door number th three out of four from here, apparently. There might be five doors though. Yeah, there are five doors. I don't know what's in door number five, but we're gonna go to the safe door over here. No! Ugh, I can't get down! I must not be able to get down because Ku increases the size of my hitbox. Okay, now we can get down. There's a star piece in here, and I'm guessing door number five is- <gasps> Okay, this is door number five. I don't know which- how are we supposed to know which door to go through? Is it door number four? Is that the door we need to go through? Yeah, we already went through door number three of five. Come on, dude, come over here. He's- he's leaving this one alone. Maybe this is the right door. It is the right door. <laughs> I don't know how you were supposed to know that. Whoa, that- that dude! There's no sword copy build in this game, but there is the freeze ability. Well, I kind of- I kind of want the food, and I kind of want the one-up, so how about we do that? How about we do some weird copy ability switching and just do this? Also, these guys remind me of the guys in Planet Robot, the little robot dudes. They usually have just the spark ability, though. Wait, is this- is this parasol or is this needle? Because I really would like parasol. Okay, we get cuttered because reasons. Is this fire? What is this? I kind of want this. I like all these star pieces. I like what's going on here. Alright, let's zoom over here. I feel like I'm going faster now for some reason. Okay, we are back here. <laughs> Give me the star pieces so I can have another one up, please. 
Thank you. Another one up. All right, eliminate this door thing so I can go through. Oh, we're back here. Did we go backwards or something? Oh my goodness, the guys that are painted on the wall are coming to life and they're coming after me. Maybe I need to have a running start so the momentum gets kept with my flame. That might be it. Oh, this is it. <laughs> we missed the star piece, but yeah, I don't- Dude, I don't know how to get your friend. I don't know how to pick him. Maybe we were supposed to press the X button? I'm not so sure. Alright, how do we- how do we do this? Oh, I was pretty close to the one-up. I just couldn't do the right- I didn't know the exact pixelation of everything. Alright, we are gonna fight Addo, who I thought was our friend, but apparently wasn't our friend. <laughs> All right, Addo, I have, I have flame. I also have, I don't want you, Gooey. I always press the wrong button, I'm telling you. Wait, it's an ice dragon. Do we not fight her, we fight the ice dragon or whatever she paints for us? Well, good thing I have flame because I feel like this should definitely help out with the ice dragon. All right, we defeated him. Wow, she's mad, I can't believe it. Yeah, we definitely don't hurt her at this, at least in this stage of the fight. It's a fish! We gotta defeat the fish now. I think Flame's pretty good for fish, too, because we're gonna cook him alive. And he's a deep dive fish, too, so he's not used to warmth. Unless he goes near one of those underwater volcanoes. Whoa, he's got the sun! It's supposed to be just his lure, but he turned it into the sun for a second. Alright, Ada, what else do you got for us? I only have, like, three hits left in here. It's- oh no, it's Mr. Shine and Mr. Bright. These guys are tough, especially when you're down to health that you can't really waste. Whoa. Shine, bringing down a shine thing. I need my power up. I'm dead. Well, that didn't take 10 million tries or anything. Don't tell me. Now we have to fight Cracko? This is the worst boss fight of all time. First Mr. Shine and Mr. Bright, and now Cracko with no copy abilities? I don't think that the Cracko clouds give me any copy abilities either. How are we? S I think we're just supposed to spit and stuff, because I don't think, yeah, I don't get anything from that. I gotta inhale and then jump up and spit it out. And I, oh my goodness, he's shooting lightning down. This is ridiculous. Can we get this and then- ugh. It's very hard! It's a Kirby game, but this this set of boss fights, the string of boss fights, is very hard. Especially since Krako is considered a main boss, not a mid-boss, and so are Mr. Shine and Mr. Bright. Whoa, 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 he's aggro on me. Come down here. Okay. This is going to take a very long time because each of his clouds does one damage. One damage. So it's going to take a long time. In the meantime, Addo's just hiding behind her paint easel over there, lounging around, seeing to see what will happen, watching to see what will happen. And I don't know if she's seeing what she wants to see. I got defeated several times before this. I'm not getting hit by lightning. I say that now. Don't get hit by lightning, because we already said it. All right, finally. Is that it, or does she paint something else? Oh, now she's coming after us. Did we get hurt? Do we inhale her? What do we do? I'm gonna slide after her. This, this won't solve anything, but, oh, Kirby dance. That means that we must have won. Okay, level five. Where are we? Iceberg. Why, why did Choo Choo just pat the snowball? He's trying to make a snowman. Oh, there's Pitch. Gooey, what did you do? Are we gonna put Gooey on the thing? Oh, we put a hat on Gooey. Oh my goodness, that is freaky. Wait, were those tongue things earlier supposed to be Gooey's? 
I don't know. Also, that looks like a very suspicious tower over there, so we're gonna have to go after, go over there. Um, just for future reference, that boss fight took me a literal 20 minutes. Usually the entire recording takes 20 minutes, so... Anyway, I'll see you guys next time in part 9 of my blind playthrough of Kirby's Dreamland 3.